Welcome to this channel. In this particular tutorial, we would be simulating a inverter amplifying circuit using 741 LM741 op amp and we would be simulating this particular circuit using the KiCad tool. So before going into this particular tutorial, for more such videos and for more such tutorials, request you to like, share and subscribe to my channel below. Now we have already created a 741 inverter schematic and click on place symbol. Now when we place the cursor on the schematic, we have to choose our symbol. Now in the filter type LM741 and click on this LM741 and place this particular op-amp on the schematic window as shown in this particular tutorial. Now right click on the op-amp, click on property, edit property and define the aspect as mirror around x axis. Now click on place symbol and place the cursor on the schematic window and in the filter we have to type P spice and click on register place this particular resistor on the schematic window right click select properties edit property define the reference as R1 and define the value of resistor as 270 and orientation as plus 90 now we have to place the second resistor so click the cursor on the schematic and select the resistor and place the second resistor as shown in this particular tutorial right click select properties edit property define the reference as r2 and define the value as 8 point kilo ohm now in order to rotate this particular resistor select the orientation as plus 90 as shown in this particular tutorial. Next. Now click on place global label and place this particular global label on the schematic window. Now define this label as V in and place this label on the schematic window. Similarly we have to place the global label VCC and place this particular global label VCC on the schematic window and also place the global label VSS or VEE and place this on the schematic window. Next click on wire and connect the V in to the resistor R1 and from resistor R1 to the terminal 2 of the LM741 and the terminal number 7 of OPAM is connected to VCC and the terminal that the resistor R2 is connected to R1 and terminal 2 of LM741 and VEE to the terminal 4 of 741 OPAM. Next click on place power port and Place the cursor on the schematic window and select the ground and place the ground on the schematic window. Next click on wire and connect the terminal number 3 of LM741 to the ground. Now connect the terminal 2 of the resistor R2 to the output of the operational amplifier that is LM741. Next for this particular circuit we have to define the voltage source. Before that click on place no connection and place no connection across the terminal 1 and terminal 5 of the operational amplifier. Now click on the place symbol and click on 
D schematic window. Now type P spice and we require the voltage source. So we require the voltage source VCC, VE and VN. So place three voltage source as shown in this particular tutorial and we have to define uh, those voltage source accordingly based on the circuit what we have done. So place the three voltage source as shown in this particular tutorial. Now we have to define V in, V e and V c c. So click on place global label and define this label as V c c. Click OK and place this on the schematic window. Now place the label V e e and place it on this particular schematic and place the label V in as shown in this particular tutorial. Now we have to place the ground connection. Click on ground and place the ground connection as shown in this particular tutorial. So place the ground connection accordingly. Now click on wire, connect the VCC to terminal 1 and the second terminal to the ground, connect the VE to terminal 1 and the terminal 2 to the ground, connect the VN to terminal 1 and second terminal to the ground. Now right click on the voltage source, click on property, edit property, define this as VCC, define the value as 5 volt and click OK. Right click, click on properties, edit property and define the reference as VEE, define the value as minus 5 volt and click OK. Right click, click on property, edit property, define the reference as VN and define the value as 0 click on edit spice model, click on sinusoidal, define the DC offset as 0, define the amplitude as 1 volt and frequency as 1 kilohertz and click OK. Now the most important aspect is to define the model for LM741. So click on properties, edit properties, define the reference as U1, click on edit spice model, click on model and click on select file. Now we have to select the appropriate model. So select LM741 and click open and select the type as sub circuit. Click on alternate node sequence and define this as 32741 sorry 6 and click OK. Now click on place graphic text and we have to define the spice analysis so define dot tran 4 milliseconds and 8 milliseconds and click ok and place this on the schematic window click on tools click on simulator and run this particular simulation now the simulation is complete click on probe and place the probe across the V input and place you can see this particular input waveform and click on probe and place the probe across the output pin you can see from the simulated result the input waveform and the inverted output waveform of the inverting amplifier thank you for watching this tutorial i hope this has helped your learning purpose I request you to like share and subscribe my channel below